With WP Affiliate Platform installed and activated, let's go through some of the main configuration settings. To get to the general settings, click on WP Affiliate, then Settings. Working from the top down, you can start by configuring the language for your affiliate program. It defaults to English. Now, change the title that is seen by your affiliates when they log into the affiliate control panel. The cookie life determines the length of time that an affiliate will be rewarded with a commission after sending a potential customer to your site. For example, with the default setting of 21 days, if the customer makes a purchase within three weeks of visiting your site after clicking an affiliate link, the affiliate will be rewarded a commission. Next, specify a currency symbol for display purposes. Then, specify the currency code for the currency that you would like to pay your affiliates in. Now, enter a contact email for your affiliates to reach you or the affiliate manager. You can now specify a default landing page where customers will land after following an affiliate link. You can configure the affiliate login URL in the next box. Click the instructions link for more information about this option. If you created a terms and conditions page, you can paste in the URL to that page here. If you want to give your affiliates the option to track their links, enable the custom field tracking next. Now, specify which of the buyer details you would like to reveal to your affiliates, if any. You can promote WP Affiliate Platform within your affiliate dashboard in the next section, or you can turn it off completely by checking this box. Now, move on to the Affiliate Signup and Registration Specific Settings section. By default, all new affiliates are automatically approved. You can choose to manually approve all registrations by checking this box. Also, you can set it up so that you add affiliates manually and not allow any visitors to sign up at all. Next, specify whether you want the PayPal email address field to be mandatory. If you want to give the option to pay affiliates by check, select the box to show the Payable To field. The Tax ID field is shown to affiliates by default. You can hide it with this setting. If you would like to receive an email each time an affiliate signs up, select this option. To incentivize signups, you can offer a registration bonus. Enable it and enter the amount here if desired. Next, in the Commissions Settings area, you can choose what the commission rate will be. The Used Fixed Commission Amount setting is there if you would like to offer a set dollar amount as a commission rather than a percentage. If you're coupling WP Affiliate Program with WPE Store, WooCommerce, or a direct PayPal integration, this next option lets you reverse commissions automatically whenever a refund occurs. The next section gives you options for allowing your affiliates to refer other affiliates. You can specify the commission levels and for how long the parent affiliate will receive commissions from their referrals transactions. The next section allows you to configure the CAPTCHA settings on the affiliate signup page. This ensures only humans are signing up and not any automated scripts. The next section allows you to customize the affiliate area by modifying the text for the main pages in the affiliate dashboard. After making any changes in the general settings, be sure to click the Update Options button. Now, click the Email Settings tab at the top of the page. The top checkbox allows you to turn on notification emails to affiliates when they refer a sale. After activating and saving, you can enter the text for the emails that get sent out. You can do the same for sending notifications to admins by checking the next box and customizing the email message. The third box is for sending account approval messages to affiliates. Again, you can customize the emails that get sent out after enabling this feature and clicking update at the bottom of the screen. Below these three checkboxes, you can configure the email that contains the login details that get sent to new affiliates. Be sure to click the Update Options button when complete. 